Yes, sir. Two and zero in league play. You had a nice afternoon. Offense had some big play potential and, and cashed in on those opportunities today. What did you kind of see against that a Golden Eagle defense? Uh, yeah, they mixed it up pretty well. They were um, they were a blitz team, but they would they would hold it. So uh, meaning that they would bring it from depth. So it kind of confused me a couple of times. They would bring a, a saw blitz, the same on the wheel, and play zero coverage behind it. But they would hold it so well that I sometimes didn't have the protections right or have the, the right the right run intact. So um, to be able to sit in there a couple of times and, and get some plays off against that against that certain coverage was was nice. Slowed down for you. I mean, you've been a guy that's had so many years under your belt, and you can really slow things down. And you escaped with a lot of pressure and found those guys downfield for those big plays. Yeah, um, I was telling my dad about that the other day. Um, that sometimes, um, I'm not going to say it's easy out there, but it feels a lot easier than it always has been. Um, and I think that just comes with experience, like it does for anybody. Um, the more snaps you play, the more the more you notice certain things and in coverages and can pick it out. And um, whereas maybe sometimes you go through a full progression, you can X out things on certain sides and get to what you know is going to be open quicker. And that uh, it also helps take uh, hits off of you in sack. So, yes, yeah, so I would say slow down a little bit, but um, just got to keep pushing and uh, trying to make it easier and easier as we go. Fourth game this season where the offense has kind of exploded. Is it because you have so many weapons that you can turn to at any given time? No doubt. Um, yeah, I, I mean, having a team like this where you've got the wide receiver room, first off, is so, so deep. You can bring guys off that bench for for days, and it's always weapons out there. Um, uh, I mean, you don't you don't lose much as you as you bring guys off the bench. Um, we got three good running backs, um, and we'll have some more in the, in the future years to come. We got a good old line. When we get going, we get going. Um, pass protection it, when it's good, it's good, and uh, when you give us time, we have guys that can win, and it makes it easy for me. You mentioned you know some confusing things off the bat, but you guys took some deep shots off the bat. Was that by design? Yeah, no doubt. Um, and some of those shots we took could handle the salt pressure. So um, whether it be an 80 or 81, um, and then luckily a couple of times when we when we took the shots, they got out of the saw, so we were able to get it off. And I had DJ running wide open one time. Um, I know that on the, we had a Lulu, uh, we had a, uh, a corner post running wide open, and then we also had Smoot who was he wasn't wide open, but he ended up being wide open when we, we threw him threw him wide open. So uh, yeah, that was nice. How about DJ's day to day and then your ability to kind of add him to that attack a little bit. Over yeah, no doubt. Um, uh, it was first off the takeoff. You expect that from him, but then we have never, we've never thrown him a tap, which would be a jump ball in the, in the end zone. So um, that was a new play we had this week. And we started him on one side, jumped him uh, to the other side of formation, just seeing who they would run out there with him, whether it be a corner. Most of the time they run a backer out there with him because he has him in man coverage down far in the red zone. But um, they ran a corner out there, and I thought they were going to cloud it there for a second, but then they backed off, and I just went ahead and gave him a chance, and he made a good, a good catch. Personally, how fun is it for you just being able to play, being able to be on the field and play free? It has to be just so exciting for you. Yeah, no doubt. Um, each week's a blessing, no doubt. I've, I've learned the hard way that it, I mean, it can be taken away from you. But yeah, like I've said before, I'm just blessed to be in this situation, um, to be healthy. And I'm having a blast playing right now and uh, not ready for it to end anytime soon. Did they see enough of you when you took off running there? Then you, we never saw you again after. Uh, I guess so, man. I thought maybe if I slid, coach would have kept me in. I don't know. But yeah, that was probably wasn't very smart anyway. So.